MMO RPG. Stands for Massively Multiplayer Online Role Playing Game. AKA World of Warcraft. That's right, this is my universe. And I played all the way back from 1994 Zorks vs. Humans. And this is my Azeroth. And I've been playing World of Warcraft since release. And I even played that number three, The Frozen Throne. September 2nd, 2001. That's right, my first expansion was a Burning Crusade. And wherein that touched my itch, and I don't really like the Lich King. But the expansion was a cataclysm. And I can't believe the fourth Mist Bend area was announced in BlizzCon 2011. Yeah, 2000 million million subscribers. That's right, we've got 8 million. And I can't believe that this is the Guinness World Record for MORPV people playing all at once. And a server holds 17,000. And well, my avatar, well, it's not a rogue coming at you from behind in a PVE environment. That's right, it's players versus environment. My subscription is prepaid and it's set up to blow your mind away in a categorized language of oh shit I just I'm stuck in roleplay mode and I think I'll switch my mode off and talk like someone else for a little while because well I'm undead and I'm coming at you to heal you <clears throat> sorry about that let's get back to a little bit of poetry in an ongoing world of character development this is a chain quest line to give you a legendary task force a mission and that's right, all the way back from the beginning was a series of real-time strategy. And this is fantasy steampunk genre of science fiction wherein griffins, dragons, and elves are powered by autonomous zombies, werewolves, and horror monsters in a time travel space dilerium alien world concept. That's right, this is now a 3D adventure and I'm sure the graphics are a little bit old, but I think it's really cool because I get to save other people through instances, raids, and man, that just makes me drool at night while I'm dreaming. I'm dreaming of saving others. I'm gonna life grip you back and drop a light well at your feet in the public trade chat channel, and I'm gonna tell you that, well, I need 10 gold, or maybe even 50p, or a couple pounds to drop off the weight of my back because, damn, that arm needs to be reattached because I'm undead, that's right. And I purchased everything from, well, no, I didn't, never mind. I don't use the auction house because I don't that that kind of time. I'm just a software developer playing a 30 day trial timeline from that world on the other side of the expansion. And let's go back to the Burning Crusade where I was a druid and, well, I played Boomkin and my brother was a warrior. That's right, arms. And we went into. We went into those arenas 2v2 and we wiped everyone with the floor except that warlock and druid combination. They made us drool real hard bleed out and man we rage quit so many times that I had to do with my little brother and well let's just say I never use cooldowns because well I believe that's too much like a rogue and I hate those bastards almost as much as I hate death knights but they're not as bad as the blood they roll off and the activation of the content that they don't even know what else to roll and they just put their talents and everything back in the day and I've got ten in this and ten in that and the holy tree has only got one out of three oh well at least I can still heal in shadow form now. <laughs> I feel so complete. Come at me, bro. I'm going to mind play you, then I'm going to psychic horror, and maybe I got a, th a couple phantasms. This is my activation earning 63% of the world of MMO RPG. No Trojans. <laughs>